Hi, I recently passed the EWS Solution Architect Professional exam and I'm making this video to give you 3 tips that helped me pass the exam and I will also try to answer some of the questions that have been asked the, to me by my friends and maybe you are also trying to find answer to them so let's get started so the first question is how tough is the exam if you are just starting your cloud journey i don't really recommend starting with this exam it requires you to have a lot of knowledge about cloud architecture and you also need to know a lot of details about ews products and their use cases you should also be comfortable with automation and infrastructure management if your daily job consists of managing on-premises infrastructure the way of doing it on the cloud is a little bit different so you have to know how to use event driven architecture and a little bit on how to use serverless and cloud formation next if you are lucky and use EWS product on a daily basis I can tell you that the exam is not difficult at all you should focus on product that you don't use much and you are good to go the most important question now is how to prepare for the exam so first practice every topic and be sure to know how to do things don't just watch courses or videos and think uh, you have grasped the subject practice practice and practice more you can do a lot with the ews free tier and use it to your advantage some scenario will require of course that you spend outside of the plan but it's not really a big deal remember this is a uh, part of the investment you make in your career use what is free you can take a look at my youtube channel i have been doing some videos about some topics related to the exam preparation there is a lot of free courses on ews training website also read the documentation and the white papers i can assure you that you can find all the answers to the exam questions just by using these resources finally take a practice exam personally i have uh, I bought the one provided by EWS and took it to just see how the questions looks like. This will put you on the on the right mindset for the exam. So next question is how long does it take to prepare for the exam? Well, as I said before, it will really depend on your experience on the cloud infrastructure and EWS products. But there is one important things it is your dedication you should make time to study and eliminate all the excuses of being tired for example you need to invest your free time wisely that's all it takes so now i will show you three tips that helped me to pass the exam so first try to answer short question don't waste your time on those big complex questions because you can't waste any second and you have to score as much point as possible before the time runs out. This is what happened to me. I used all the exam time. So the second tip is if you read the question and you feel like you don't know much about the subject, just flag the question and um, skip it for review at the end of the exam. This will allow you to focus on scoring more points on other questions and spare your energy. Lastly, on some questions, you will have two answers that are correct, but one of them use an expensive combination of products, for example, or they will added some management overhead. You can easily eliminate those and you are good to go. So. That's it folks, I hope this was useful to you and I wish you good luck for your exam. If you liked the video, don't forget to smash that like button. Thanks for watching.